Well, the coronavirus has caused the shutdown of Maryland public schools. As a result, school administrators really been busy trying to come up with contingency plans. Yeah, the leader of the Baltimore City School System came out today urging parents not to panic about any of these closures. And WMAR 2 News, Dave Detling was out there today speaking to parents and has a look at one of the schools and their remote learning plans. Dave. The coronavirus has schools all across the state of Maryland closed and here at the Waldorf School of Baltimore, staff have been busy disinfecting and preparing for the possibility of long term closure. With the sounds of spray bottles, there was a little laughter. <laughs> Rolling with the punches, um, but I love them so much, so I think we'll, you know, we're getting through it all. <laughs> First year teacher Angelique Gilbao spent her Friday ahead of spring break without her students. She and fellow staff members at the Waldorf School of Baltimore were on the offensive line against the coronavirus. So we're deep cleaning, sanitizing and also lesson planning, preparing for what it's going to look like after our spring break. Down the hall, Sharon Barkhauser was busy packing up learning support materials. The brown paper bags are stuffed with students' personal items should they have to learn from home. They'll have their exact crayons they use, their colored pencils. I'll be um, doing different exercises with them with bean bags, the same ones we do in class. So I think it'll just continue giving them that rhythm, something they're used to, so it doesn't really disrupt their life so much. It's extremely important that we are prepared for an extended closure because we don't want kids to fall out of their rhythm or fall behind in some of the essential learning that needs to take place. Always the concern is continuity of learning, learning gaps. We know that large numbers of our families and students um, are very susceptible to long periods of time away from school. WMAR2 News saw that same concern for education at Midtown Academy as Lucy Hernandez picked up her children's learning packets. She said the principal was ready to meet with parents upon pickup. Uh, she had uh, buckets of um, different grades, really organized, and she just already had their names on it. She just pulled it out and it was that easy. And the hope is that students will be able to return to their schools after spring break, but administrators are reminding parents this is an evolving situation and they are keeping them up to date. In Baltimore City, Dave Detling, WMAR 2 News. All right, Dave, thank you. Now, while schools are out, Anne Arundel, Baltimore, Carroll, Howard counties, as well as the city, have listed areas where students can pick up free meals. And we have posted all the details on our website, WMAR2news.com slash coronavirus. And there you're going to find a list of all the closures like the Pratt Library, as well as other shutdowns.